So my name is Todd Steffes. I'm the Vice President of Healthcare Practice at FICO. And, and just tell me a little bit about what you do as far as managed care goes. Okay. Most people know FICO as the FICO credit score company, and, and we are a decision management company. Um, and what we're trying to do is take that predictive analytic technology and move it, move it into the healthcare space and answer business questions in healthcare. One of the key questions recently has been how to improve medication adherence. The cost of non-adherence is tremendous in the industry, upwards of $300 billion in healthcare costs. So we utilize our predictive modeling capabilities in addition to our access to third-party public data, demographic information, um, uh, income factors, retail purchase histories, etc. And we find that that can be very predictive when combined against a uh, therapeutic class model um, that examines how patients previously have adhered to, to therapies. And we can use that information to predict fairly precisely how likely a patient is to stay on their medication for 12 months, just using name and address and, and matching them off of public data. The value there is that you have a, an early proxy for a, a healthcare stakeholder, whether it's a payer, a physician, a pharmaceutical manufacturer, um, a retail pharmacy even, um, that wants to improve patient uh, care, help people stay on medication appropriately longer, um, and reduce the extended healthcare expenses that could happen with people who go off medication inappropriately. So if you know upfront who is most likely to be at risk for non-adherence, it allows you to take stronger, faster advantage of the interventions you have at hand on, those, on the right patients so that the patients at the highest risk get the highest amount of care and the patients that don't may not need as much uh, uh, help staying on therapy. You don't have to spend your, your resources in that area, so better resource allocation.